but the thing with that is we can't access to the ship right now. And okay, Rondas has been uh, here. That I can see because of the freaking ice bridge. Wait, no, it's, it's not these enemies that I am. Uh, the reason I wasn't shooting at them is because I thought that you needed to use the grapple beam or grapple lasso in order for us to uh, uh, kill them, but it's a different type of enemy that I was thinking about. They look similar to those, but not really. And of course we have our cinematic uh, uh, cutscene, which says the name of the place in the lower right corner, and we're just getting the feeling of the of the place and all that. And oh, that's uh, da, da, da. We moved. No. Uh, okay, going this way. Ah, it's so nice to have the space jump boots at the beginning of the game. Because, well, this is like the only game where you don't lose anything in the beginning. The only prime game that lets you keep all the items that you have the, from the beginning. Which isn't much, but it's still something. Uh, wait, where am I? Where am I supposed to go? Wait. Maybe I went the wrong way. Look. Yep. We're supposed to go down. Hip. Activate that, which makes this little, little gel fuel thing. You're going. Ah, whatever. It unlocks uh, one lock uh, to the door there, which is where we need to go. That's right, we are not going to go for the ship now, because even if we went that way, we wouldn't be able to access it. Whoa! I totally forgot you! Oh, no, 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 stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it, no. Alright, so... The way to defeat this phase on uh, night uh, parts is... So wait for them to circle around and create energy, and then when they yeah start up their attack. Okay, maybe I need to move a little bit like this. And uh, hello, can you start your attack, please? Hey, I'm trying to show. Oh, oh. And you're seeing it like that. When they begin to circle around and make the green thing, that's your cue to shoot the hell out of the green uh, thing. Not at the enemies themselves, but aim for the green energy, and that will kill all of them. Speaking of green, we have unlocked the another lock on the door. And a little shortcut. Or we open one road and close another. Magnifico. More of you? Really? Okay, which one are you going? Oh yeah. Oh, you're both attacking at the same time. Ah, good thing I have these uh, free aiming. Oh, I forgot to scan you, but never mind, I will have more chances of scanning you. Wait, 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 hold on. Which way am I supposed to go? I am supposed to go to the right, I believe, but. The. The. I'm just gonna remove the ball. And go to the left because I think there are something waiting for us to the left. And it's a door. And oh, 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 nice. Or maybe it was here that I was supposed to go. Ow. Right. 
Another one of you. And you will be seeing these things. Um, what these things are like face on, face on wines, which are impervious to weaponry, but with hyper mode we can easily shoot them off like that. And what she didn't explain is that you can exit hyper mode by holding down plus, which means that you don't have to waste all the energy or health that you spend to activate hyper mode. So you can uh, like activate it, defeat uh, the few enemies and if you have like half of it left uh, or something then you haven't really wasted uh, a lot of health. Anyway, I am... Okay, I'm trying to... <sighs> okay, fine. Screw the sequence breaking then. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on. There we go. Ow. Rubble shouldn't be able to hurt me. Anyway, going the way that I did now, nets you a uh, missile expansion. So, which is going to be good for me to have. Hmm. I f yeah, this seems to be the right way for me to go. Uh, oh, yeah. Introducing the local enemies of this place. Or the intelligent, intelligent life. Uh, in, on this in this place. Alright, let me scan you. Reptilius Hunter. These enemies can cloak. Which can be bothersome since you don't have any ways of seeing cloak enemies as you are right now. But the despite them having the cloaking yeah a device. They don't really attempt to uh, use it that much. Not, not in the first fight, anyway. Yeah. Oh. They also have a whip that they really like to use. Yeah. Whoa. Okay, I thought that he disappeared in a wall, but apparently he was only using uh, yeah, the cloaking device. And with both of them dead, we can proceed. Yay! Alright, so if we look at our left, we are seeing this, so let's just do this. And we have a Briar Lore here, which explains the tale of. Uh, the one of the like uh, the intelligent uh, beings on the 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 planet that uh, was exiled from the whole thing. Now was this the ship? Or it it begins to tell the tale of uh, beings that was like in the same class as the Lumov and the Konsko, where which found their home here in, on Trials. I I don't remember much of the lore thing on this. It's better if you will like uh, play this yourself and scan all of the things, or just read it on the uh, wiki. Alright, so there's uh, the missile expansion up there. So what you need to do is collect some of these in order to make yourself loot. And watch out for that little monster thing, since if you fall into its grabs, it will grab you and kill you. And when you reach your destination, just drop a bomb, kill them off, and collect what you wanted. 
And with that done, let's go back down, get rid of you, and continue onward here. Pull you off and doing that, and we get our next upgrade. Has changed position on uh, the chair here. And we get the grapple swing! Yes, it is not called the grapple beam anymore, since grapple beam is in three different categories actually now. The grapple lasso, which we gained first, grapple swing that we got now, and the third one, which we will not be getting until like very, 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 very much later in the game.